I'm leaning towards yes on that one. I think somebody else is here. We'll see how it goes. Cool, here's those radiators, however you call that. This is really cool. Here's a windshield wiper. <laughs> cool. How's it going? <laughs> Do you ever hear anything about what they're doing today or no? Uh, they're doing a hot dog thing and a birthday party for Windows 4. Oh, okay. Huh. It's a number 111. Sesame Street today was brought to you by the number 111. Please do not climb on the engine. Well, there's a ladder up here. I'm assuming they mean don't climb any on the top. It would be fun to get up here on the very, oh, you see? Here's ladders right here. Oh, stay off ladder. Bummer, they read my mind. Saw me coming and they're like, no, don't do that. But as you can see, it's not even that flat on top and there's no handrails. It doesn't look particularly safe out here. Of course, if there was no sign saying not to, I'd probably do it. <laughs> Who am I to argue with a sign? It's a nice sign. Emergency fuel shut off. More knobs to play with down here. Mystery knobs. Very, very rusty wheels. Notice there's the original stairs right there, but they got some easier stairs for us. I don't know what this mystery compartment's for. Look how it's like loosened already. More knobs. There's the wheels. Huh. I wonder if that's actually damaged to the electrical wiring or something. Very interesting. At least it's a sunny day out here. The lighting is pretty good. I think my camera is picking this up pretty well. I mean, look how dirty it is up there. I think it's supposed to be like that. I think that's grease. Look at this. Where's this thing supposed to go? Is that a drain or is it missing a piece? Or both. <laughs> oh wow, these are Hubble connectors. Four pin Hubble connectors. All sorts of good stuff down here. Okay. Well, let's check out the mystery caboose, shall we? Burlington Northern. Not Santa Fe, just Burlington Northern. There we go. International paper. <laughs> I was thinking, here's the steering wheel, but obviously that's for the brakes. So notice, oh yeah, they don't even have connected together. The couplers are next to each other, and the air brakes are disconnected. Interesting. Man, those things are huge. Oh, wow. Wow. There's a strange place for a rung. Hang on to it so you can climb up, not fall down. We got a fluorescent light now. Ice box for food and water. A typewriter. Wow. That's a nice one. No wonder it says do not touch. It's like a legitimate antique right there. I like the soft green it's painted. All sorts of mystery doors. Capola. Well, it doesn't say not to go up, so by the process of elimination, let's see how the view is. All right, well, notice I can mostly look over the locomotive. There's a chin-up bar. <laughs> Just kidding, it's probably a safety bar. I'm not sure what that number means. It looks like it might be pressure. Obviously, it's not the temperature. There's another caboose. A real train, I don't think it would normally have more than one caboose on it. I think it would just have one for the brakeman, that's it. Oh, no, it's been so long since I've seen a train with a caboose, except as a shoving platform. Oops. All right. 
Well, as long as I did that side, might as well do this side so it matches. Heaven forbid I'll be asymmetric. Man, these rungs are pretty far apart. Could have some nice long legs if you want to do that. Got some decent spider webs here. Holy cow. It's in pretty good condition though. It's nice out here. <laughs> nice bird poop. That's a view. This is Highway 101, the northbound lanes. That's a good street for sightseeing. Okay. Let's see if I can get down without falling to my doom. Here's a hole. I'm not sure. I think it would have been a chimney in the good old days when they had a fire or wood stove in here to keep warm. 